KNBC 9 News starts with breaking news. That breaking news involves the Kansas City Chiefs. The team could be without two of its three best players in the season opener. I'm Laura Morris. And I am Bria Berry along with Lynn Jennings. First, it was Chris Jones, and now we're talking about Travis Kelsey. Yeah, this is uh, some bad news for the Chiefs. Kelsey hyperextended his knee during practice today. His status for Thursday's game against the Detroit Lions is now uncertain. Kelsey's the top tight end in the NFL. He caught 110 passes last year for 1,300 yards and 12 touchdowns, leading the team to a Super Bowl victory. This is video of Kelsey during an earlier practice. Head coach Andy Reid provided the update this afternoon. The next guy steps in and we roll. I mean, that's that's what you do if, that, if that's the case, you know. Can you provide any kind of update on the status of uh, Chris Jones in terms of any progress or expectations? No progress. Yeah, no progress. If you can hear, Reed was talking about Chris Jones, who hasn't been with the team for six months while he looks for a new contract. Chiefs players told our Karen Kornacki that Kelsey was injured during a red zone drill, but he, but he walked off the field on his own power. Now, if Kelsey were out, the Chiefs could rely on Noah Gray or Blake Bell at tight end. They could also rely more on those seven wide receivers that they have on the roster. Oh, man, that's We're a lot of wide receivers. Speedy that recovery. That is true. Step up. Yeah. <laughs> And then thank you. The Chiefs will lift another championship banner ahead of Thursday's kickoff at 722. For everything you need to know about the new season, just visit KMBC.com.